Hello friends, uh, in this video tutorial, we will learn how to install CentOS 7 in a simple way. So for this demonstration, I am using Oracle VM VirtualBox and inside the already I created a one VM for CentOS 7 and mounted a CentOS 7's DVD ISO image. Uh, now select install CentOS 7 and hit enter. Select your preferred language as well as the keyboard type which you have. Take care not to forget to choose the correct keyboard or else you will end up with a few scramble keys. So for this demonstration for our case it will be English and US. So click on continue. Now here's about the localization and the time date and time format. According to my region I am going to select Asia Kolkata. Click on done. Here's the keyboard settings which I am not going to change and there's a the language support. For uh, installation source, already I selected now auto detect installation media that is we have our ISO image. Here's the software selection and for this demonstration I'm going to use genome desktop or you can also use a server with UI. Management console. So let's take a server with UI and click on done. Okay, here's the installation destination. Click on it and uh, select the partitioning scheme so i'm going to create a partitioning that's why i'm going to select i will configure partitioning click on done here's the partition scheme that's uh, lvm or standard partition so i'm going to select the standard partition then uh, click on plus sign it will ask your add a mount point and for this i'm going to select slash boot I'm going to specify the size 500 MB, click on add mount point, again click on a plus sign, select mount point, I'm going to select slash, I'm going to give a size 50,000 MB, click on add mount point and a third, I'm going to select swap and that will be a double of your RAM, for in my case it will be 4096, click on add mount point. So I just created a three partition. And as we are seeing, a CentOS use XFS as the default file system. So I just created a three partition, slash boot, slash, and swap. Click on done. To continue, let's say, accept the changes. Here's about the network. And uh, if your network is connected, you'll find out over here. I'm not going to configure right now. And uh, you can also specify the host name from over here. And let's give CentOS 7 hyphen demo. Click on done. Click on begin installation to start the installation. Here is user setting. We have to specify the root password. Okay, say it, uh, password is weak, but it's okay for the demonstration. Click on done. User creation. I want to create one of the user. Okay, let's specify the username. That's uh, user1. And uh, let's specify the password. Okay, it's saying the Password you have provided is weak. The password fails the dictionary check. It's based on dictionary word. You will have to press done twice to confirm it. And here's a certain advanced options which we have, uh, like create uh, user's home directory, or you can specify the user's custom GID and UID, and as well as you can add this user to a particular group. You are not going to specify anything, and just click on cancel. And that's it. The installation is complete successfully, and now it will ask you to reboot your server. Hit on enter to reboot your server. And that's it. We got a screen. Let's log in with our user. And here we go. We have our newly installed CentOS 7. Say so, uh, click on next. Click on next. And we're gonna start using CentOS Linux. That's it for this video demonstration. In our next video, we will install a VirtualBox Gas Edition tool in CentOS 7. Thanks for watching this video.